Today we'll build a outdoor case for a Dig Squad controller with the AE Plus board on top, which supports an SD card. And we're going to build that in a CG1500 box. So here we have laid out everything we need. The enclosure, power supply, controller, and all our wiring already with barrels, ring connectors, and spade connectors put on to help us out. We have the mounting plate. This does not have holes for a quad, so I have a 3D printed adapter that actually has standoffs for the quad printed as part of it. So let's go ahead and first we can connect the power supply. Flip it over. Let's connect the quad. We can then connect our power cords from the power supply to the quad. Okay, let's start with our enclosure. In this case, I took off the door to make it easy to work with. All our wires to the bottom. So I have the AC cord plus seven pigtails we will run through. Then we can bring our mounting plate in. At this point, I usually try to hook up my wires before screwing the mounting plate down, just in case I need to move anything around a little bit. So we'll start with the AC wire. And then we can work on all the connections to the dig quad. In this case, I'll need to take the ESP off so that we can get to the first four ports. And there we have all the wiring done, so we can go ahead and drop the mounting plate down into the enclosure and get everything screwed in. For now, I'm just going to take the antenna and attach it to the side. The lid reconnected, we now have a completed box. For one last test, we can go ahead and plug it in. And we can see that the boards light up correctly.